A Fox exclusive breaking late today, a newly unearthed email reviewed by Fox News Digital connects President Biden's education secretary to the controversial letter from the National School Board Association that compared parents who were protesting at their school board meetings to domestic terrorists. Correspondent Jillian Turner gives us the backstory here from Washington. Hi, Jillian. Hi, Martha. So new emails obtained through a FOIA request appear to show the Secretary of Education may have solicited that now infamous letter from the National School Boards Association, the one that critics say conflated parents of U.S. students with domestic terrorists. Now, previous emails revealed that the NSBA was in contact with the White House and Justice Department in the weeks before it sent that letter. But this newly obtained correspondence indicates Secretary Cardona himself may have played a direct role. Now, in an October 5th email, the NSBA secretary treasurer recounted that fellow NSBA official Chip Slavin, quote, told the officers he was writing a letter to provide information to the White House from a request by Secretary Cardona. Facing backlash recently, Secretary Cardona has made efforts to ally himself more publicly and more closely with parents. Take a listen. Parents have put up with a lot over the last year and a half trying to uh, balance work and uh, educating their children. So this partnership with parents needs to continue. Parents Defending Education, a group that's criticized school curriculums and closures, tells Fox News, quote, should this allegation be true, it would reveal that this administration's pretextual war on parents came from the highest levels. On September 29th, the NSBA sent a letter to President Biden. It warned that, quote, America's public schools and education leaders are under an immediate threat. The group then asked for federal law enforcement to step in and help, suggested triggering the Patriot Act, P Patriot Act as a means to do that. They have since apologized for the tone of that letter, Martha. All right. Uh, Julian, thank you very much. Julian Turner in Washington. Hi, everyone. I'm Brian Kilmeade. I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click to subscribe to the Fox News YouTube page. This is the only way that I know for sure that you're not going to miss any great commentary, any great news bites, any great interviews coming your way on Fox. You can get it all here on YouTube. So subscribe right now.